If gun control worked, it would have. Back in the 1970s and 80s, gun control was a popular notion in the United States, and the federal government in many states passed many new gun control laws, and the violent crime rate soared. Now, this doesn't prove that gun control leads to violent crime, but it indicates it doesn't help. Starting in 1990, states began to repeal many of their gun control laws, and we went from 10 states that allowed people to carry guns in public for self-defense to 42 states, and the crime rate plunged. This doesn't prove that gun rights lead to the suppression of violent crime, but it shows that it doesn't hurt. Let's be smart. Let's not repeat failed experiments of the past, and let's admit that armed self-defense may be part of the solution. For clear perspective on guns, violence, and laws, visit gunfacts.info. Thank you.